tried the W4 variant, the diesel W4 variant of the XUV300. So I'm gonna take you through all the details and features available in the basic variant of the XUV300. It's the diesel, of course. Mm, yeah, so everything feels really good. Like everything feels solid. Even the basic variant has got auto down feature for the driver window. All the materials feel good, as good as on the W8 variant. Only thing missing is that uh, there is no soft padding for the doors, door handles, I mean door armrest. And yeah, the steering has not got any buttons on it. So that's another thing. And the display, info time, uh, sorry, the instrument cluster of the driver, it's not as premium as on the top model it's got all the features though like it's got distance to empty it's got fog illumination setting and everything it's everything is there but it's it's just it looks decent it's good it's not too bad and then it's got this uh, steering setting as well so now it's in normal mode that is sports mode for you and the next one is it is the comfort mode so in comfort mode it's going to be of course light so that is there and the AC is manual only thing you have to adjust the temperature through this this is these buttons here and it's just one big huge fan speed controller audio system is basic it's as uh, similar as uh, the TUV 300's uh, T8 audio system it's good but sound quality isn't well it's 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 okay it's just decent but yeah they provide it on this variant as well now my major grouse is like uh, the key of this car it's a 10 lakh rupee car on road and it's got these bike like keys so, yeah it's got central locking of course but it's manual only it's not remote and they've got uh, daylight feature for the mirror as well, so that is good. But the thing is, the front portion of the cabin does not get any kind of dome light. Only the rear seat gets a dome light. And it's just a, just a yellow light. So it's not white as well. The seats are okay, there is no rear center armrest for the passengers. And there is no height adjust for the driver as well. But it's good, it's decently equipped. Rest the rest of the things are the same, same glove box, nothing different. And yeah, even the top end model does not get the telescopic steering edges. This one gets, so there is no difference as well. It's the same. Yeah, the there are electric mirror controls, but there is no folding. This is just a dummy here. So this is the basic model. So now, why am I insisting uh, and keep? repeatedly saying that this is the diesel basic model uh, that's because the only the diesel w4 variant gets an audio system the petrol w4 variant does not get it mm, yeah and that's maybe because of a pricing reason for an entry level pricing reason or something the rest of the things are the same it's get a, it gets an usb aux and it's the same six speed transmission the diesel engine is the same 1.5 4 cylinder 115 horsepower it's good it's good it sounds good well i'm yet to take a test drive of the diesel variant you have you may have seen the petrol uh, xuv 300s review and i'll soon get to drive a diesel variant as well thank you signing off see you on another video Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe for more videos. If you like this video, click the like buttons and give your comments.